All right, welcome back, guys. It's time for Bonnie's Barnyard. Bonnie Keys from Mulberry Lane Farm joins us. And since it's Mother's Day this weekend, we have a special baby edition today, yes. don't we? We do. <laughs> Being Mother's Day, like yes. you mentioned, we thought, why not bring the symbol of fertility? Yeah. Babies. Babies. Yeah. So and what do you want to start out with this morning? Because we have a lot. <laughs> well, let's start with rabbits. Okay. Because they are the symbol of fertility. And uh, the bunny is actually called a kit. A kit. And you guys, I don't know if you can see them, but we do have baby bunnies down inside. Here. Yes. They're sleeping right now. And what's interesting <laughs> is the mom, the doe, will pull hair from her chest to line the nest. Because when the baby kits are born, they, you could say they're blind they and are. naked. And naked. Yes. Yeah. It takes about 10 days for their hair to grow and their eyes to open. Okay. And we actually have some baby bunnies or kits that are about 10 to 14 days old. Oh, oh yeah, baby, baby. Oh, so their baby. eyes are open now, although this one's sleeping. Oh, There's a little baby. Look at you. Hi, honey. And, full, and they're, they're fully uh, clothed, let's say. Now they have their hair. Oh. So sweet. You were saying they sweat in weird places. These, yes. As cute as these guys are, they sweat in some weird places. Yes. It's actually the pads of their feet. That's the is, only place, It's right? the only place that they sweat. Look at that fuzzy guy. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. Now, these guys also drink a lot of water. They do. <laughs> they, a four-pound rabbit will drink as much as a 20-pound dog. Oh, my goodness. So they, they do like their water. And another interesting fact is you always see them kind of chewing yeah, away. Yeah. Their teeth never stop growing. So they need to continue to chew to wear down those teeth. Oh, wow, so interesting. Mm -hmm. All right, let's switch gears now yeah. to what does Brian have in There's front of him? Right well, now. Brian has a baby kid goat that's just a couple days old. Oh. And Jenny, I have a baby kid goat for this, you. I think I may take this oh. little guy. <laughs> Look at so that little sweet. one. Right. <laughs> oh, my goodness. And then, sweetie. These guys are newly born, too. Yes, right? they are. And for Mother's Day, um, <laughs> The, the moms and the families love to come out to see the babies. And last year, Mother's Day, the moms had the experience of watching triplets being born. <gasps> That's right, the cows, right? The yes, calves, the yes. Cows, they were born last Mother's Day. And then also oh. Farmer Cindy has That's one sweet. of the lambs that's about 10 days old. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, and then yesterday we had a school group on their tour. They got to see babies just born, oh, and they were yeah. still wobbly. Mom was cleaning them off. So this time of year, we have baby everything. Oh my God. So. They're adorable. Yeah, they're so <laughs> everything cute. is. And this little lamb, you guys might remember, her mom was on the show last month, right? Yes, she was uh, one of the sheared sheep, Daisy. This is one of her um, oh. twins that was born. The other twin you can hear in the background if yes. you listen real closely. <laughs> but, um, you know, Mother's Day, moms are admitted free with a paid okay. admission. So it's a great family outing to it come is. and see the, the baby calves, the baby kittens. Um, you know, there's so many babies, I can't even name them all. Well, definitely, I encourage you guys, if you have no plans for Mother's Day yet, go to Mulberry Lane Farm this yes. Sunday. Your kids can spend time with all these <laughs> cutie dope. pies that we have right here. And, of course, Bonnie, what's your website? One more time for people. They can visit our website, mulberrylanefarmwi.com. And it gives you all the information there. And besides seeing all the animals, you get to learn some really fun animal you facts. You definitely do. All right. Well, thanks, Bonnie. Thanks, Farmer Cindy. We'll be right back. <laughs>